Hi there, here we are at 4th Avenue, unit number 210. The past tenants left it in excellent condition. Just a few uh, wear and tear items that we'll need to get fixed here. Uh, first, we'll start off with the closet door in the entryway. It doesn't shut properly. Um, I'm guessing it's just from the settling of the building. In the kitchen, um, there's a few hinges we're going to have tightened. Uh, this, this door isn't closing properly because of that bottom hinge there, as well as this hinge under the sink cabinet. In the living room, we have, this is, uh, this needs to be repainted. Some of it's normal wear and tear and some of it I would call um, tenant damage and we'll charge the tenant probably one third of that, that wall. And um, this wall also, I tried my best. I went around the whole unit with a rag and um, some cleaner to get the scuffs out of the walls. Some scuffs came out really easily. This one I can't get out, so we're probably gonna have to repaint this wall. Um, this wall is okay and I'm gonna ask my handyman if we can have these um, fixed. It's like this in a few of them. It was like that before the tenants moved in. Um, it looks like they just broke and um, I'm not sure if we can get an easy replacement for that. Let me check my notes here. So um, one of the major things is the smoke alarms. They have just expired so um, during our rekeying, when the, once the property gets leased, we'll have all the smoke alarms replaced. And here uh, we have one light bulb out. I took off the cover there, don't worry. And in here, the pop-up drain is like really hard to use. So. Definitely want to have a plumber come out here and fix this. I can see first if the handyman can fix this before we send out the plumber. So um, just usually handymen don't like to touch the plumbing because uh, of the risk involved. Um, and here, this closet door also is having the same issues as the other closet door in the entryway. In this bedroom, this is where the most of the uh, paint damage or the painting will be done. The tenants left a, uh, a banister holder up here. So larger than normal wear and tear and um, a few holes around the, around the wall, some bigger holes like that. So this wall right here will definitely need to be repainted. Um, this will be charged the tenant two thirds paint to them, as well as this wall. Um, as you, I think you can see there some marks, and this would be in you know considered normal wear and tear. All this scuffing here, so uh, we can probably you know charge the tenant a little bit. But I also noticed there's a banister you know holding marks up there and right there. So, in like some areas like that, you also can see the, some marks from a picture it looks like there. So anything with like paintings with little holes like that, we can't charge the tenant for, but um, this room will pretty much need to be fully repainted. Definitely just this, this wall and this wall, and I'm sure they can blend it in, stop it short. We'll go over to the other side. Uh, the bathroom seat is uh, super, super loose, so we'll go ahead and tighten that. And the washer. I'm testing the dryer right now. I just test the washer, it works great. Um, this is the only issue is I can't, if you push it down real hard, it will turn, but 
the only way to do it is like this. So I can have a technician come out here and um, check it out. We're definitely going to need to have this looked at just so the, um, you know, this is something a tenant will complain about in the future for sure. Um, let's see if the dryer, dryer is working well. Yep, dryer's working. So, in this room, just one wall will need to get touched up, or, um, excuse me, not just one wall. We have these marks down here, just your normal wear and tear. So, I mean, I'll have, I'll get a estimate for you on the paint. Basically, I just tell our painters to make it rent ready and they know they work for us every day. And, um, I'll check the last work order for the last paint job you did and make sure, you know, we don't get charged more than that. But yeah, this room, not this wall, this wall's perfect. Um, just this wall here, this wall, and this wall. Uh, I also noticed that there's marks in here and, uh, you know, pretty big scrapes and dents like that. I'm not sure if you want to get this repainted. Um, if we did, we'd have to take out this whole unit here and um, I'm just, I don't know if it's that big of a deal. Some tenants might complain, but you know, it was there before the last tenant, so it shouldn't be that big of an issue. Um, all the other doors close great. Let me just review my notes. Oh, install an HVAC filter in here. This one's super dirty, so we'll install a new one. And then also the uh, filter in the microwave is super dirty as well. Um, and the last thing is install doorstop on the patio. A couple, couple more things. So install doorstop here just because the, the door handle keeps hitting the wall and chipping the wall. So we can prevent it from chipping anymore. Um, install a light bulb there. And then also there's a spring up here that looks broken and it keeps running into the wall scrap or the uh, trim scratching the trim so yeah that's that's about it and um, if there's anything else i missed i'll include it in my email to you i hope you're having a great day and feel free to you know call me text me about any of this um, i'm here to help you and make it right so we'll, we'll get it rented quick and yeah i'll talk to you soon bye